Welcome to the business side of town. So as you can see, we do have a full Boss Aluminium M4 tray canopy package on this D-Max. What is that? Okay, if you don't know too much about Boss Aluminium, those guys manufacture this stuff in their facility down in Melbourne. All Australian owned, Australian made. Those guys do a fantastic job, as you can see, at the finish of their products. So, M4 means basically you're getting one piece guards, toolbox, underbody water tank, trundle drawer, it kind of comes with everything. So if you want to go Mac Daddy, this is the tray for you. If you want to start a little bit more basic, then you would go the M1. M1 is literally a tray, no sides, anything like that. Two piece guards, no toolboxes, no trundle drawer. So if you want to go very, very simple to start with, you could do that. And then you could buy the one piece guard and opt up. So M stands for modular. Everything is bolt on, bolt off. You can change things out and kind of change up your setup if you wanted to progress like that. Or you can do a braid and it's done and just boom, buy the full boss setup and away you go. On this one, he's got everything. He does have the tray sides as well. So if you go M4, you do get tray sides, all that type of stuff can come with the unit. So canopy is removable. You can get optional legs with them as well. Pop the caps legs in, wind up, bloop, drive out, away you go. You've got a tray again. And then slap your sides on and away you go. So it makes it very, very versatile. If you are using it for a touring system or for work and you're like, cool, I just need to tray because I'm moving house or whatever. That is the good thing about this being paired up with this tray. You can have both. So don't be scared. All right, Boss makes their own roof rack to suit the canopy. So if you've got ladders or any form of work gear that you want to run, or you're just swagging it, boom, straight there. You've got plenty of tie down points, even on top of the rack. They've got channel nut slides, so uh, uni strut. And basically you can pretty much do whatever you like up there. Most of your roof rack accessories will work with this system. So this is built by those guys to suit the canopy, but it is very, very versatile with a lot of accessories that are out there today. All right, let's open it up. This is the kitchen side, so to speak. Mostly on a kitchen side, you'd want a fridge. So in the dual cabs, because they are a little bit shorter than your larger four drives, like one of those things over there, uh, the cruisers or even a 200, if you've got a chopped one or anything big, American trucks, that means that this is a bit shorter. So you don't have the luxury of a full 130 litre fridge, but look what Bushman's does. They do a nice little 85 litre fridge. So you can have this, you can have the Dometic as well if you like. And don't fret, if you do still want to run the good old school slide out, drop down slide, you can do that. Just be mindful that you've got to have enough room to get that fridge out past here so it can drop down. So there are limitations to that, but it is possible with a few brands. The main one that we use and that Boss likes to use as well is the Clearview slides. So hit up the guys about that if you want a bit more information. I like these because Boss makes this awesome surround that goes in it and they are way lighter than a good old chest fridge setup. So if weight's a thing for you, have a thing about that. All right, so we've got the T15 drawer here which allows for great storage in the top, but boom, instant bar, mate. Look at this. I'm telling you, crack a frothy and away you go. <laughs> I'm not going to do that now, it's too early. Um, but I use this for a cooktop. If you want to do that, you can do that. Preparation, all that type of thing. One-handed open and close on this, which is great. And then, Drawer's got the lockout as well, so that way it's not sliding in on you if you're just stopping on the side of the road. All right, like I said before, don't forget, this is a modular system. So the inside is no different from the outside. You've got the drawer here. Everything bolts in and out of these canopies, even the uprights. Upright, if you don't need it, you can pull it out. Drawer, if you don't need it, you can pull it out. Boss does trays, 
three quarter trays. That way, if you want shorter ones or long ones, you can do all sorts of different bits and, bits and pieces. So very, very versatile. Let's not forget though, on the doors, all the doors, three point locking. So you've got a bar that runs across to each side of the doors and your pin in the middle of the handle as well. Uh, Braden's opted for central locking in this, so it is all central locked off the vehicle. Hit the button, blip, cool, everything's locked. So you can opt for that if you want to do that and a little bit of lighting from the guys at Hardcore as well. So that is all in this canopy setup on this one. All right, let's go have a look at the other side and I'll show you how versatile these things can be. Huge amount of space in here. So as you can see, Braden's gone, yeah, look, I don't want that right in the middle of here. I'm gonna move it to there. So in the floor, we've got all of these options on where you can put that upright. So if you want it in the center, so you can actually run another drawer or one of the other features that Boss has available, you can do so, or it's just an open space. So if you're using it for work during the week, whatever you need to do, chairs, anything, look at the amount of space that's in here, it's massive. Absolutely fantastic. So as you can see, we've got a little bit of power coming from our battery up the front. And we've got a little fuse outlet and everything here. The guys from Boss have this awesome inlet system that comes through the front of the canopy. Like I said, it is a removable canopy. It's all plugged at the headboard here. So that way, if this is coming off, blonk, blonk, away you go. Happy days. But a massive amount of storage in here, guys. And like I said, Boss offers a massive amount of accessories that can bolt into here and bolt straight out again, even power systems. You can get a straight bolt-in power system, take it straight out if you don't want it in there. So really, really good bit of kit. If you didn't know from Boss, this is what they do. So I love them. My favorite, got one on my cruiser. It's awesome. All right, let's talk storage down in the tray, full toolboxes, driver side, passenger side, and they are central locked. Like I said, he did opt for that with this setup. On the back, spare wheel holder, on the driver's side, and he's opted for the Boss Aluminium lockable jerry can holder. So this thing here, lid off, lid on, away you go. Ladder for the back, if you've got a rooftop, fantastic. He obviously is using this for access onto that roof rack that we talked about earlier. And then, full trundle drawer system. So this also has the lockout feature. So if you are on the side of the road or doing whatever you're doing, You've just got yourself an instantaneous removable tabletop as well. Boom, look at that. You can use that for food prep, anything that you want, put your drinks on there, and a massive amount of storage in here. So this thing's fully sealed, dustproof, waterproof. Away it goes. Three point locking on that as well, so don't forget that. Okay, what else is on the back? As you can see, sensors. So Boss makes room and they have thought about reverse park sensors, blind spot monitoring sensors, and your reverse camera as well. So all those features that were in the tub transfer onto the tray. So you're not losing any of that. It is all available with the Boss aluminium tray set up as well. And then last but not least, passenger side box. And look what I've got in here. Nice little ARB twin compressor set up. Easy access, whack your air up in there, and away you go. You can smash it out on the beach and uh, get some air back in your tyres before you head home. Little tip for beginners, run your compressor with your door open. That allows air in for the compressor to obviously compress. And they get hot when you're using them, so let them breathe a bit. All right, but that is one other thing. Almost forgot. Have a quick squeezy in here. 70 litres worth of water underneath, and we do have a tap and a pump on the back of the tray as well. Pump on, open the tap, boom, you've got instant fresh water as well. So that is all filled up at the headboard, and then that way you've got onboard water. So if the canopy comes off, you've still got water. So fantastic bit of kit from those guys at Boss. Really, really like that. 